First this, we're getting the first witness accounts from a bus explosion in Israel this morning. Two people told Israeli radio they saw someone throw a bag into this bus in Tel Aviv. That person then ran away and the bus exploded. An emergency worker told us that at least 10 people were hurt, three of them seriously. Secretary of State Hillary Clinton is shuttling between Israeli and Palestinian leaders this morning. She's trying to help with a peace deal. Some Arab leaders hinted at an agreement yesterday, but instead this has been going on. Israel's military blew up buildings, tunnels, and bridges in Gaza last night, even while a CNN reporter was on the air. Look. Oh, I think it's pretty clear that uh, we are moving in the direction of... I can hear shattering glass out there right now. The building just shook, of course, because I was looking at the camera. I didn't see where the blast took place. Anybody see it? Okay. To the north of this building here. So... Despite talk of ceasefire, Hala, it appears that uh, the guns are still firing. But sirens rang out in Israel as well as new rockets kept coming in from Gaza. One of them hit inside the Tel Aviv area. And Israel says it launched 100 strikes overnight. Many people in Gaza are leaving their homes because they don't feel safe anymore.